guys, Caleb's Cards here, coming at you with a TTM mail recap. Uh, possibly the return out of uh, return, uh, TTM returns, I don't know. Um, I haven't really sent out anything. Uh, I don't really have access to any uh, address sites at the moment. I put those on a hold um, just to save some money. And then, uh, I don't know, sports card form is for free. I'd use that if I could remember what my password is. Um, so I can't get in there. Uh, until I figure that out, but uh, I have gotten some back that uh, some stragglers, I guess you could call them, uh, that have been out for a while. Um, a couple emails that came in, and there's still plenty of email requests out there that could potentially show up uh, later on. But I thought I'd come on here. Uh, I figured maybe I can try and do uh, recaps maybe every two weeks, maybe to a month, uh, depending on when I get stuff in. And then we'll try and continue the World War II series, uh, going over um, the World War II returns that came in from Scott, at least doing like three a day or three a week. Um, we kind of get caught up on the backlog of those. I have about 20 or 30 of those. And then I also picked up a few vintage cards, uh, baseball cards. I haven't done that in a while. So we might, uh, every once in a while, there might be like a vintage baseball card uh, purchase video. Um, so I, I got a card kind of uh, that I've always wanted for a while, uh, for a decent amount. Um, it wasn't too expensive; I think it was under twenty still. But uh, you know, check it out, COMC or eBay, things like that. And uh, it was you know the videos will come out as I think of ideas. Um, obviously, I still gotta finish going through that box. I finished going through the one. Um, that other brown one over in the corner is uh, stuff that go out for free. And then the other ones behind it are ones I'm still trying to put away in the containers. So I've got a lot of cards to go through and try and uh, slim it down. I've gotten rid of quite a, probably close to 20,000 already. So um, I guess I'm doing, slowly making my way through that. So anyways, let's go ahead and jump in and show you what I have for the TTMs. I do have to show you a failure though first because I goofed up and uh, made a mistake. I sent... Uh, these three cards to Quadri Ishmael. Although I did not send them to Quadri, I sent them to his brother, Rahib. <laughs> uh, I know you can't read that note because it's upside down, but it says, Caleb, these are cards from my younger brother, Quadri. Uh, grace and peace, Rocket. So, I mean, we kind of got a signature from Rocket Ishmael. I don't know why there's three index cards. You don't want to do two, but um, I remember I found an address on StarTech. I was going to try for Quadri. And for some reason, I addressed it to Rahib. <laughs> so uh, I don't know if I also sent to Rahib around the same time too, or what. But uh, so I'll have to maybe in the future try and find that address <laughs> again. So that was my bad on that one. So that was kind of stupid. <laughs> uh, kind of funny though. Um, but we will go to some successes here. Just a handful. We got this is over the last two weeks or so. Uh, this is not including today, Saturday. I don't think I have anything coming in, as far as I know. But uh, you never know. I guess we'll just save it for the next time. Um, we got former coach, also NHL analyst, color commenter, uh, Don Cherry. Uh, this is a 4x4. Four 4x6 four. Um, four wouldn't come out very well, so I just made it 4x4. Four four. But that uh, he signed that for Bruce. says, to my bud. This is the one he signed to me. says, to my pal, Caleb. So, me and Mr. Don Cherry are pals. So, there you go. And then he included one of his own uh, advertising for his sports grill. Um, says, to my buddy, Caleb, Don Cherry. So, very cool. Pretty cool uh, advertisement, too. It's got a dog in there. Fireworks in the back. Put a lot of effort in that one. So, that's pretty cool. Um, next up. Go some sports. Or the rest of the sports like Olympians. Um, these are pretty cool. We got Rebecca Sony. Um, this is a card that I got from the antique mall. And uh, that was in like a pack of the uh, uh, Olympic cards. So I, I went through it to see who signed. Uh, most did it, and surprisingly a lot were passed away. Uh, even though that said it only came out, you know, six, eight years ago. Um, 
but she did sign that one, and then she signed the two protective index cards. One, she put a note, uh, she said, Kayla wishing you all the best, Rebecca. We'll have to figure out and see if I can make this camera not mirror <laughs> and put everything upside down. I'll have to, I'll have to go check the settings. Uh, this is a brand new computer for me, so I gotta relearn where everything is. Uh, different brand too, I've never had an HP. Um, got Jesse Diggins, she's a, I think it's a downslope skier, an alpine skier or something like that, so pretty cool, I don't think I've ever sent to her before, but found some pretty cool looking photos there, they came out really nice, and this one's pretty cool, this was sent out for autographs for Akira a long time ago, back in 2020, I honestly thought this was never coming in, um, but we got Mr. Maybe the most famous or infamous out of this entire Maori, Lance Armstrong. Pretty cool. I used to want to, when I was a kid, wanted to be a bike racer. And uh, I know he made a voice appearance uh, and a cartoon appearance, I guess, on one of my favorite shows as a kid growing up, Arthur, on PBS. And so I wanted to be a bike racer. So obviously that uh, never happened. And uh, I know. A lot of stuff has come out since then. He's stripped of his Tour de France wins and medals and all kinds of stuff for steroids. Um, I don't know if steroids really made a difference for him in those races or not. I don't. I don't know how that how that would work. Maybe I know uh, some like certain steroids can give you know build more muscle. They can build. They give you more energy, uh, keep you going. I, I don't know. But maybe it helped him. Maybe it didn't. Who really knows? So uh, maybe there's some people that know a little bit more about it than I do. But uh, and definitely he was a big time athlete for a long time. Just really sad how uh, that uh, ended up coming out. Um, I have gotten, I don't know if it's his wife or sister. I uh, imagine it's his sister. But, uh, I don't know, they're Kristen Armstrong. And I do have a card for her that I might send out some one of these days. Because I found it after I had already gotten back from her. I was like, oh man, I could have sent this. So, I would have just gone through my cards a little sooner. So that was pretty cool. Um, I know Michael did get him in when he was signed at the time for August Breaker. But I'm sure he would love another one. So that would definitely go in his pile of autographs to send out to him. I'll probably... It's been it's been piling up pretty quickly, so I'll, I'll either send it before Christmas or around Christmas time for him. Is usually what I do, and then uh, if he wanted to keep some that he didn't think necessarily he could uh, use for the charity, he can definitely keep for his collection. Um, next up is a email from Germany. Um, this woman is a the German Bundestag president. Uh, I think the Bundestag is kind of like House of Representatives kind of senators kind of thing like we have here but this is barbell loss and she did uh, there was like a note from like a secretary or the person who was fulfilling the email requests so pretty cool dear Ked Craig please find kind attached the autograph for the president of the German Bundestag you're sincerely uh, looks like uh, M. Soul I'm not sure so very cool so barbell loss and then I just to make sure I remember who they were, wrote it on the back, so it'll always be there. <laughs> and next up, we got two returns that are sent a couple months apart from each other because I don't remember doing that, but I guess I must have found a card, sent it, found another one, forgot I sent, or asked if he would still sign, even though I just wrote him, uh, Mr. Tracy Lawrence, country singer. Uh, he has some really good songs. I'll be listening to him. It's a pretty recognizable voice. Uh, he also, if you're a fan of like podcasts, um, I believe he does do like a country music podcast. So um, he does have that. Um, then, then this is one of the other ones he signed, uh, 90, 92 CMA. And then he also again signed the index card. So very cool. So probably because I mean we got four index cards now, and maybe even one of the cards might be a something for like a giveaway or prize or 
Christmas gift or something in the future. So we'll see. And finally, we have an email request from a French actor, actress, Vanessa Gouge, or Gage, I think it actually is. Uh, she, uh, it's kind of hard to see, but you can see it's kind of over her sweatshirt there. Um, she also wrote a little note in the back. Um, the address down below is not current, so I'll have it out. So don't try that one. But uh, very cool to get back from her. Um, she was very kind on Facebook. I sent her a thank you. She replied, so that is it. So that is everything I had for the last couple weeks. Again, not a whole lot, but uh, some pretty nice quality ones, I would say. Definitely have to say my favorite is the Lance Armstrong. Uh, brings back a lot of pretty uh, cool childhood memories. And I uh, never thought that was coming back. So and I was surprised it actually came back from Colorado. Uh, this came from Grand Junction. So I don't know if he's in Colorado or if he was like Utah or something nearby. Because I think I sent it to Idaho. But it's possible that uh, it could have been postmarked at Grand Junction if he was like in the lower part of Idaho. I don't, I'm not sure how that would work. But uh, yeah, so that is it. That's everything. Thanks for watching. Let me know what you think. And uh, if you got any ideas or uh, some critiques or anything like that, just let me know. Uh, certainly if it's within my parameters or within my ability to do so, I can try it and uh, work things out or um, take on those criticisms and uh, do the best I can. So thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you enjoy and have a great weekend. Saturday, I'm going to take my sister out and we're going to go visit some shops around there and see if we can find some treasures. So maybe you'll see another video today. Who knows? So talk to you guys later. Bye.